Are you good? If not, let's get good. It's Thursday night, and tomorrow night I will be starting our Fallout 4 daily series. Now, in order to do that, we are going to need a Vault Dweller, but not just any Vault Dweller. I am going to be showing you guys a selection of Vault Dwellers. They are going to have names, previous occupations before the bombs dropped, perks that they are restricted from using, and perks that they are expected to focus on, and then you guys will be able to select the Vault Dweller you want for the series. First, I'm going to introduce you to Aaron Goodman. He is a, or he was, a Boy Scout leader. He is restricted from the perks Heavy Gunner, Iron Fist, Ninja, Cannibal, Dash, Idiot Savant, and Bloody Mess. He will be focusing on the perks Rifleman, Nuclear Physicist, Gun Nut, Armorer, Blacksmith, Science, Local Leader. So, all in all, Aaron Goodman is your general good guy. He was a Boy Scout leader. He's obviously a very positive figure. He's the type of person that likes to help people out. Now, the perks that he's restricted from are perks that he's either too old to do effectively or that just don't fit the character very well. And the perks that he is focusing on are mostly crafting perks because he was a Boy Scout leader. All right, so with that guy introduced, let's move on to the next one. And our next Vault Dweller is Kenny Jim. Kenny Jim is loosely based off of the special effects guy from the movie Tropic Thunder. And his restricted perks are Nuclear Physicist, Gunslinger, Rifleman, Science, Sniper, Ninja, and Sneak. The perks he will be focusing on are Heavy Gunner, Demolitions Expert, Gun Nut, Armorer, and Blacksmith. So basically, he is an all-around, let's-blow-stuff-up kind of guy. But he doesn't really have the finesse that you would expect from, say, a Gunslinger or a Rifleman or the stealth of somebody that you would expect to use Ninja. Next up, I am going to be introducing... Dr. Albert Von Schatz. Before the bombs dropped, Dr. Albert Von Schatz was a psychiatrist. He is restricted from the perks Gunslinger, Commando, Rifleman, Big League, Steady Aim, and Sniper. His focus perks are Wasteland Whisperer, Inspirational, Medic, and Science. Dr. Albert is your typical high charisma, low combat skills character. He's going to be looking to talk his way out of situations far more often than he's going to be looking to shoot his way out of situations. I expect him to be particularly challenging if he's selected because no combat skills, really. Alright, the last Vault Dweller that you guys have the option of choosing is Jimmy Wompton, who is our crazy redneck. Now, Jimmy Wompton is restricted from the perks Nuclear Physicist, Armorer, Science, Robotics Expert, Ninja, Nerd Rage, and Animal Friend, because we all know rednecks are not friends of any animals. They tend to shoot them. So his focus perks are Lone Wanderer, Cannibal, Idiot Savant, and Attack Dog. That's because he is a crazy paranoid redneck, and the only person he trusts is his dog. And I just thought the cannibal thing was kind of funny. So anyways, guys, those are our four Vault Dwellers. I will let you select one in the comments. Let me know which one you'd like to be our main character for the series. Thank you for watching, and please game responsibly.